Hello, hello, hello. <laughs> All right, guys, I think we're good to go. Let me make sure that this is working. And absolutely. All right. Long time no see. Well, you've been seeing me, but uh, I haven't seen you or talked to you guys in a long time. All right. I don't know what's going on here, but all right. <laughs> hello, guys. Hello. And today we're just playing some games. I know we didn't stream. Did we stream last week? No, we did not. But I've been putting up a lot of uh, content, so I hope that you've been finding them useful. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> hello, hello, hello. All right, guys, let's do this. I'm just going to be accepting challenges, so it's just to get to answer any questions you have or simply playing some games. So let's see if we get some good games today. <laughs> All right, nice to see you here. Yeah, but times change. We gotta be changing, guys. Always changing. I cannot let you get used to it. Hello, hello, hello. Happy Thursday, guys. Happy Thursday. It's already almost mid-February. And uh, yeah, 2023 is, go is flying by. It's flying by. All right. So I already got some games in. Let me just refresh. Make sure I got your challenges. Richard, Richard, how are you, mister? Are, you, are we playing today or what? All right, guys, I'm playing first game, 10 minutes. Remember to... Ha <laughs> ha, come on. Okay, re remember to show some respect, first of all. Second of all, remember to... Let me take this pawn. Remember to try to add some increments. So probably better than 10 minutes, 5-5. Five, five. Anyways, when you have the increment, it's going to be probably the same amount. And also, let's try to, um, well, 5-5 five, five is good, 3-2 is good. Don't make it too long, like 15-10. Not, I don't think it's going to be a good idea. All right, so I'm going to try to keep it in my elements. I got a free pawn. My opponent did not, it's not going to castle. They moved the king. So this should be pretty simple. But still, tactics are always in the air. Romania, nice. What part of Romania? I actually visited you, what? I think it was 2021. Well, actually, yeah, two years ago. Two years ago already. <laughs> Italian opening, you got it. You know, I don't think we've played here a lot of Italian openings. All right, let's do it. No, no, not today. <laughs> not today. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I have to set him as an example. So, destruction and Richard just spoke. So, we gotta go even stronger. So, e5. Now that the king cannot castle, it's gonna stay in the center. Let's try to open up the center. So, knight d4 it is looking for this open file. Twitch chat empty. Yeah, no, this is mainly for... <laughs> yeah, we're doing this mainly on YouTube and I'm just sending it to Twitch because I have the option to. All right, my opponent says, I don't care about what you, what you want, but I'm not gonna leave, I'm not gonna let you open up the center. Now, how about E4, just with the same idea of hitting that king. So E4, knight takes, knight takes. Now, nah, let me do rook E8 first. Hmm. All right, why not? Yeah, yeah, like typically I get one on Twitch and then 10 viewers <laughs> on YouTube. <laughs> so again, simple chess. Um, our opponent has the king in the center. We should do everything we can to get to that king. You got it. Okay, so I got an Italian game. Um, yeah, let's do that. Hmm, let's do that Catalan as well. Alright, so let's see who gets to whose king first. So e4, 
they're trying to come for my king, but I think theirs is a little bit more exposed. Ah, you know, guys, it, it could be interesting for training. Like, it forces you to find resources. Now, you have your king in the center. You're getting a lot of heat. So you, we need to learn how to deal with, the, with those possessions. And it's the same thing I tell my students. Sometimes we make a mistake. We blunder a piece. Don't get upset. Don't abandon. Keep playing. See if you can turn things around. Those are skills that we need to develop. So anyways, e4. Okay, so I take back. And now by taking back... I also opened up my fianchero bishop, so the knight is not hanging. So I think we got a piece, and next thing you know, I'm going to pin whatever it takes me on e4. So simple, again, simple chess, if there's a pin piece, we have to try to add more pressure to it with the least valuable piece available. I could have played um, bishop f5, but then f3, we don't really win a lot of material. With the pawn, we're guaranteed to get that bishop. Okay, so take or take. I mean, there's no rush, so let me take here. The bishop is not going anywhere. Yeah, Richard ordered it. So. <laughs> yeah, but still, even with that, and look, soon we're going to be talking, guys, about defending. Like, everyone gets so excited about attacking, combinations, how to close your games, but we haven't talked a lot about rules to defend. If you're in a bad position, what should you try to do to defend? And soon we're going to be going deep into it. But first, let me see if I can... Ooh, that was a pretty cool... That was a pretty cool move. Mm. Okay, can I save my knight? Maybe queen f6. Alright, there we go. Again, no rush. I don't want to give my opponent anything. I think we had c5, but I think queen f6 improves the queen and defends the knight. Of course, you might be thinking, what if the bishop leaves? Well, if the bishop leaves, I think we still are in, in good shape. Uh, yeah, and a lot of us, we, we just av avoid it, but we should try to get better at it, just like anything else. Well, the title, it is what it is. It is what it is. It is what it is. Okay, so now, oh, come on. Okay, guys, what would, you do, what would you play here? I think I already found a pretty cool move, but I'm curious, what would you play? What would you play? Now, at the very least, you should be thinking of rook takes, and at least I get two pieces for, for the rook. But what if I just play b5, interference, right? Is that interference? I think so. So I'm hitting the queen. Queen shouldn't take, queen shouldn't take, no, queen shouldn't, queen shouldn't take because of the knight. If they take with the pawn or the knight, I do have the time to collect here. And the queen is going to be blocked. Also, b5, bishop takes, I think I could take. They take me and then I collect with check and that king continues to be in the center. So let me see, queen f2, no, no. B5, yeah, B5 is the move that I'm going to play. Rook E4, yeah, definitely. No, I think he's just, um, he, he was talking about something, I don't know, something about Valentine's Day, or <laughs> I think he's coming after Valentine's Day. Yeah, guys, I'm just accepting challenges today, so feel free to do so. All right, so this is looking good. And we finally take it. Now, let me see. So the plan was to just take on e4, but what if... Yeah, let me just take on e4.
All right, that one we knew was going to happen. Now, first move that came to mind was bishop d7. But what if we just forget about that? Just connect the rooks or bishop d7. Bishop d7, bishop b7. Bishop d7, bishop b7. Bishop d7, bishop b7. Yeah, I'm thinking, well, nice c2 right now, we gotta be careful. But uh, bishop d7, queen takes, but now my rooks are connected. And I got a four coming in. But no, 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 no. They're gonna take it after. Then the queen is in. I think bishop b7 is safe. And we have talked so much about this, guys. If you're already winning, don't give your opponent any counterplay. So I think bishop b7. Mm -hmm. yeah, let me go bishop b7. All right, we're gonna go over it quickly anyways if for any reason i don't get to explain everything that you need on lesson 85 guys the beginning of lesson 85 is me explaining to you the difference between them and then, yeah i mainly talked about the how the moves are different but yes the fact that they have an extra pawn on c4 in the king's indian it's uh it's a completely different position they're very very different My pleasure, my friend, and thanks a lot for always being here. I know that you're always leaving comments and asking questions. So I'm glad to see that it helps. I'm glad to, to see that it helped. All right, guys, this is just exactly what we need. Simplification. If we get rid of the queens, I don't have to worry about any counter, counter play, right? Without the queen, what trouble could they get? AB7, some of you mentioned AB7. I mean, that pawn is going to be stocked for a little bit while, for a little bit longer and it's not gonna go anywhere plus don't forget that king is in the center so i'm thinking simplification is good for me because i'm up material but ultimately that king is in trouble if they don't trade queens like e3 is now in the air like i can see someone trying to play queen d7 but then after e3 i'm not sure how they're going to get out of it okay they said i'm gonna take Yeah, so Richard, if you don't become a title player in the next five years, I don't know, man. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to do with my life. <laughs> All right, so take, take. This should be pretty easy. And then this pawn falls. Oh, how about e3? You know what, guys? Take, takes, bishop d5. So take, takes, bishop d5, rook d1. Oh, I take this pawn. I mean, there's no way I'm not winning this. Now, is this knight really necessary to chop it off, or can I just go rook c8? e3 is very attractive. e3 is just so attractive. Okay, rook c8, what could this knight do? Knight b5. Yeah, that knight, you see, I already don't like the knight. <laughs> I just don't like it. Dime, dime, ¿qué pasa? ¿Qué pasa? Richard, we're always, I'm always listening to you, man. You're the voice of the experience. <laughs> so take e3 or rook c8. Now, I don't like allowing this to happen, but then this line, bishop d5, rook d1, I take on a2, they take on d6, and then, yeah, the thing is that they, this rook is gonna have a hard time getting into the game yeah but they can't they can't Oof, I, you know it's never been a goal for me guys what i want to do is i want to start playing more tournaments now that um, i'm more into creating content and, and teaching chess so i want to play more and we'll see what happens if that leads to something more serious we'll see but 
I'm just trying to enjoy going to tournaments, enjoy it, and we'll see, we'll see. Yeah, that pro that we're gonna review that after if you guys want. But the thing is that c4 and then well, I mean we, I could always put pressure on it with the rook and the bishop. So probably you're right. Now rook e5, rook c8. What happened to my line of taking? They take and then I go here. Rook d7, that's what I don't like. Hmm. Okay, if I go rook e5. Hmm, okay, okay, I, see. I, I think I know what I'm gonna do. Rook c8, no, 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 take, take, and I'm only thinking about Eliminating any counterplay. Rook c8, rook d7, and then I go bishop f7. Whew, yeah, I like that. And I'm just thinking I don't want both rooks doubled on the seventh rank. So let's see if that makes if it makes sense. Alright, now just keep it up and don't forget try to supplement this with practicing and doing your tactics. And the rest of the videos are gonna give you very good guidance to what you need to learn, right? But we need to do much more, such as tactics and, and practice and so on. Okay, so, wait, wait, what, what happened here? Okay, it's their turn, okay. Hola, 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 hola. Okay, so that's fine. Now, rook c8, uh, okay. Bishop f7 first. Bishop f7 first. Didn't see it. <laughs> I just didn't see it. I should have played bishop f7 first. Now, still, we should be fine. I think the win is going to be this passed pawn, but I should have considered that. Yeah. I, uh, I have no choice. They're gonna force me to get the king out. X-ray. We don't have a video. A video on it? No, I don't think so. Okay. Take takes takes. Mm -mm, not good. I was like, the win is going to be the A pawn, and it doesn't look like it. <laughs> no, no, no. I think I think we're gonna win this. We got that bishop. I just don't want to trade. Let's see. Thank you, thank you, guys. Thank you. Yeah, Richard. Um, yeah, that's what happens when you when you don't calculate properly. Okay, so let me get out the way. Okay, okay. They said they don't want to take the pawn. Okay. If they didn't take this pawn, now I know that we got this. Let's do it. We gotta calculate, of course we gotta calculate. All right. You know, I think I just missed something. Yep, I did miss that move. I did miss that move. <laughs> I did miss that move. What's going on? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, 
they just did. So can we win on time? <laughs> can we win on time? Right, let me do a check. Because the thing is that this doesn't work. That's the main problem we have. That's the main problem we have. <laughs> dig, dig. Yeah, I had that move and I cannot leave. Oh man, this is a. Uh, this is good. This is good. So I was bragging that I was winning so easily, king the center, and look at this, how easy it is to, to lose this. Mm. Now what to do, what to do. Now this, anyone, who, Anyone, I mean, we should res we should be resigning here. Like, show some respect and resign. Man, we have nothing. And they always have their way around. Mm. A3, A2. Oh, let me try this. Oh man, they they let they they allowed me to to queen. So now let's see if we can survive with our queen. I don't think so, but uh... man, we got checkmated. We got checkmated. All right, guys, well done. Let me see where we where we messed up here, because we messed up big time. Big, big time. Do we have any advantage actually? Now I missed the pawn on g6, that's a fact, but I don't know exact, I don't think that was enough. Okay, white pieces, brilliant move, 90%. Now, that's not so easy to win after all. Okay, let me see what was the brilliant move. Rookie six, of course, of course. All right, let me see, let me see. Let's go from the beginning. Okay, so we got the advantage pretty quickly. All of this is fine. E4, all of these ideas were good. Take, queen of six, B5, glad to see B5 worked out. And here we're winning by five points. So where did we mess up? Bishop B7, not so accurate, but that's not gonna cost you the game. Trading, so when we decided to trade, I was bragging here about Simplifying the game again, 525. So our decision was good. There was a blunder somewhere here. Still winning by 352. Okay, this was the blunder. This was the blunder. Ah, okay, okay. Yeah, simple, 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 simple. This pawn was going and it was going nowhere. So bishop is six to protect that pawn. I just didn't show any interest on keeping that pawn yep now all of a sudden is it's just equal and then we finally blew it say yeah this move i didn't see it so now white pieces are winning there you go guys another lesson we cannot give up until it's not over until it's over so let me close this and let's go to the next game let's see if we can take it out on our next opponent mm. All right, let's do it. And uh, we're playing the black pieces, 1699. Let's do it. Okay, so this move, they could easily transfer into, I mean, transpose into a, king, a Pierce defense, but we're okay. We're okay with that. Yes, I know. It's like when you catch a, a fish and the fish is just still trying to, to survive. Yep. All right, so I, I think they're gonna try to do this aggressive attack. That's okay. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Okay, this is what? This is like a Jobaba formation. Yeah, that's why I typically play G6 first, but guys, if they play the Trompowski, 
that's not it's not that dangerous so you could just play g6 or you could play d5 uh, but yeah if you want to avoid it completely just start with move number one g6 all right um let's go d5 Yes, yes, and that's something that we've been talking about it for a long time. If we're, when we're ahead, sometimes it's even harder to play than when we are when it's equal, right? Like sometimes it's easier to play when you're down a pawn than when you're up a pawn because you have this pressure. But uh, we're working towards it. That music, guys, if you go to the, to the, to the YouTube channel, you're going to find a playlist you're gonna see Tao with some pink headphones that's all the music by itself so you don't have to hear me talk right yeah bring it on guys as long as it is not too long like 2-1 is, is great and of course put the increment because if not it's gonna be at the end just crazy chess mm -hmm. Well, you know, we've been doing, I've been doing, guys, every week, you're getting a video on tactics. Like, we've been trying to solve mates in six, mates in seven, trying to calculate. We've been talking every week, also doing some end games. So, it's there. Just make sure you follow the content that is being uploaded every, every day, okay? Now, queen b6 is always thematic here, but what about queen a5? That's what's up with queen a5. Mm -hmm. All right, so we just developed all of our pieces. We got to the middle game. Now we just play chess. You got it, you got it. What's, is that for me? And if that's for me, what do you mean? Like, what is it that I want in life? Or are you asking something different? This is seven. Mm -hmm. Name so many against the collie. So, you know, I think I have a student of mine now, now that you mentioned that, that he plays. Um, he just plays c5 like we have prepared the, the name so for him but whenever he sees Kali coming in he's just he likes this early uh, c5 and then you get a, you get a little bit different now let me get it on the board I forgot to go over the difference between peers and Kinsin and defense but I gotta pull up a, a board and let's let's talk about that about that as well you can always many players who play the name so they're always open to this c5 without the bishop on before or simply d5 and you play like a like a normal queen's gambit decline of course there's no c4 yet but with the same ideas and then knight b to d7 and so on now you know i like more like uh, being able to adapt right so you play your game and then if the position is asking for more aggressive you should be able to do so if it's if you need to play passively, well, same thing. Um, well, you know, I already got, I already got it, man. It's like, like uh, I'm currently working from home. Like we have a baby, and I get to anytime. Like now, when I finish here, just go outside, just right there. I can take it out and just play with her and and just see her grow. Uh, everyone that I care about, they're healthy. My mom, look, my mom is turning. Now on Saturday, my mom is turning 47 years old. So I'm 30, I'm turning 31 this year. And having your mom that young and everyone that you care about is healthy and, and still young, that's that's pretty good. Like look, another thing, um my okay, how do you say that in English? Not your grandma, not your grandmother, 
my great grand my great grandmother just came from Cuba. So that means my daughter gets to meet her great 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 grandmother. So to me that those are the things that matter. And that's it. The only other thing it's uh that I could ask for like we have health, people that I care about, we are close. And the only other thing that people need is money to stay alive and money is everywhere, right? So you just need to stay put and you should be fine. But there's not like nothing like oh I, I want to do this or I got what I want. The rest is just easy. And same thing, like my wife, my wife and I, we've been together since high school. Like it's been, what, um, 14 years. And yeah, I guess I got lucky. I got lucky. <laughs> All right, guys, 96. We had to take care of this 97. I know my 90 is in here, but it doesn't hurt to bring the rook over. Now, 96, I'm hitting the, the bishop. And is 94 possible or what? Pretty much sure. So candidate moves, knight d4, knight d7, c5. Hmm. C5, I like. Let's do it. Oh, we're back, we're back, we're back, we're back. Living in Miami, Florida. Sunny Miami, Florida. <laughs> Staying away. I have a lot of uh, friends and, and students who live uh, in other states, and it's really cold right now. And every time we talk, it's like, oh, man, <laughs> I can't believe uh, um, you have that weather. Because to me, I mean, I, I like it. Like, if I go on vacation, it's nice, a weekend or so, but just living in a place where you have months of snow and I'm not I just I'm just not used to it you got it you got it you got it vamos 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 No, you know, I've said it many times before, guys. I've never, like, at some point, not, not long ago, like five, well, in, 20, in 2008, I came to the U.S. and I forgot about chess. I just focused on, you know, high school, going to college and things like that. But again, somehow I got back into chess, but chess has never been the main thing in my, in my life. Now I'm enjoying it again. I'm doing this most of the time, but I'm not really looking for that. Grandmaster title and guys, it takes time. Don't think going for Grandmaster is easy, it takes time, resources. Okay, so 94. I really want to play that 94, but again, it's not we're not sure we're not ready yet. We're not ready yet. Hmm. Takes, takes, takes. No need to get ahead of us. Anyways, this king going to the king side. I don't think they they want that. Queen side, the same thing. Staying in the center. So I don't want to get ahead of myself like last time. Exactly, exactly. All right, nice to see you here. Thanks, thanks for dropping by. Okay, so now... Let's keep improving. I'm not afraid of this attack. Like, what are they gonna attack me with, right? Their pieces are not that coordinated. Okay, same thing. Let's try to get to that king in the center. I'm sacking a pawn, I know, but that king is in the center. There has to be something. Oh yes, that's true. If they castle, then that pin is coming in. Okay, guys, they asked, they asked for it. I'm sorry, but they asked for it. Knight d4 is already in the air. I'm going for it. And whatever happens, happens. 
Yeah. Yeah. Here, it would be nice to. Okay. What do we take with? I want to take with the bishop. I mean, initially, I was going to take with the queen, but this cannot be wrong. We take with the bishop. Yes, we gave a piece up, but this king is in the center. We got two pawns for it. Maybe a third one. This check. Yeah. Now, let's see how sound. Maybe it was a little bit premature, but let's see how sound that uh, knight d4 move was. Oh, uh, <laughs> lowest rating. Well, when I started, of course, I started moving up the ladder. Well, you mean over the board or you mean online? Okay, let me see here. Okay, so 80%, 83% accuracy. Wait, what happened here? And it was the brilliant move 94 because I was cooking it. Yeah, 94, guys, it does make perfect sense. Here, just you can feel it that it has to be the right move. Now, should we have taken with the bishop, with the queen? Ah, taking with the bishop. That's it. That's it. All right, feeling better after our latest game. <laughs> Let me close here, go to my next opponent. Okay, guys, I'm going to take it, but try to send increment at least. 5-5, five, five, send some increment. If you want to put 10 minutes, put at least 2 second increment. Okay, okay, wait. E4, Italian game, someone asked. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Like, I get destroyed here all the time by lower rated opponents like i just got destroyed by i think it was a 15 1600 so don't worry about that guys this is for us to get to talk and if you have questions ask even though i forget <laughs> if, I, if, if i'm in the middle of a game i just forget afterwards absolutely absolutely mm -hmm. Richard, we got lucky. We got lucky on that one. And you know it. We can't pretend like we did a brilliant game, but we got lucky. Well, that's okay. That's okay. And the, the interesting thing, and, and I want to tell you this because some people feel like, oh, it's me. I'm not so good. Like, typically, I'm around the 24 something lately. And sometimes I'm teaching and I'm demonstrating like I just go in and play some games for my students to observe and so on or I simply have a bad week and I go back to 2200 and man it's a difficult to go back up eventually I go back up but as I move up the ladder I get destroyed by 2100s 2200s of course I play a little bit stronger than that so eventually I get there but it's, it's not like oh every 21 2200 I destroy them easily it's not the case so just keep that in mind it's you should you should go back to the your your strong your strength, but don't be surprised if you have to struggle a little bit. It is what it is. Okay, same thing. King in the center. It's like nobody respects. They leave the king in the center. Nobody cares. So should I just play a five? I'm gonna play a five. See what happens. Well, six hundred. This is the same thing with being poor. Uh, when you're poor, the good news is that there's no way, there's nowhere to go but up. So you just need to put a little bit of effort and you're going to improve. 600, all you need to do, and look, I was having a lesson yesterday, um, a private lesson, and it's this great, uh, this lady, she's 400, she's getting started, she wants to improve, and it doesn't matter how many times I tell her, the same thing with most of my students, adult students. I explain to, them, explain to them the importance of tactics, playing, tactics, playing when you're that low. Well, she comes to me every week. I, I review this opening and I'm memorizing this opening, but then I forget it. I can, my opponent does something completely different to what they said they would do. And I keep telling her, you're just skipping what my, like the kids that I teach, the, the children, they do what I tell them, right? So what we do is lots and lots of tactics, tactics, tactics. So. Those drills, many adults who start learning chess, they skip that and they start reading and they want to learn about strategy and openings that this guy told them is, is good to win in five moves. And then you skip that hours and hours and hours of just doing tactics and building that pattern recognition. My, the students that I have that improve the most are those who are, when I ask him, what did you do since the last time we met? Well, I was on my iPad, just doing lots of tactics on chess kids or Lee Chess or chess.com, tactics, tactics, and they play games. Openings, I just tell them, 
develop your pieces, control the center, castle, that's it. So that's something that is important for you guys who are getting started, especially if you're adults. And adults, they have the means and the ability to read on their own and process information, right? Or the discipline. Just know what you need is that. Tactics, tactics, tactics. Tactics, tactics, tactics. All right, so enough talking. 94 or 90, yeah, or bishop before. Let me go 94. Exactly. No, and you know, not only for my videos, like, oh, I bought this course, uh, I, I purchased this course on the, on the Jobaba London, on the, on the French, on the Caro Can, but then I don't know what to do on move number 12. What's your rating? Oh, 800, I learned, I started playing chess three months ago. <laughs> and guys, nothing wrong with it. It's any field that we go in brand new, we're not going to know where to start. And there's so much information out there that it's easy to get confused. So I'm only saying because I know I know what's going on out there. All right. So, anyways, Bishop F4. I'm ready. Someone played it against me already, and they beat me. So you know I'm gonna go with everything I've got when I play. <laughs> um, just send me an email. You're gonna see on my YouTube channel if you go to the About section. You're gonna see my email. Oh, yeah. Okay, so you're just getting started. There you go. So that's for you. <laughs> now, again, just trying to get to that king, but it is important to not get ahead of ourselves. All right, now, what can we do? So I've been playing guys sort of like a little bit quick. So it's time to try to find a, a plan here. My, all of my pieces are active, my king is safe. My opponent's king is in the center. And of course, there's a pattern here, a quick pattern discovered, attack. Also, if I move that knight, my rook gets activated. What can I do? Number one, I don't want him to castle, right? So here, that would be suicide, queen side, looks a little bit safer, so I probably need to open up my bishop. I mean, move my bishop to open up my queen. Now, what's the move? What's the move, what's the move? Yeah, that's all, that's all we're doing today, guys. Talking here a lot, <laughs> answering your questions, and just playing games, okay? You know, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it because you said it. <laughs> not because you said it, but because it wouldn't be fair. But nice e5, that, that, that has to be the move. Nice e5. I'm hitting the bishop, the knight, and whatever they with, I'm going to take after... King stays in the center, bishop d7, queen d7. That's a pretty nice move. I was thinking knight g3, but it, I was not convinced. Yeah, that's a pretty good move. Mm, that's a pretty good move. <laughs> Esta vida es loca, la vida es loca, la vida es loca. <laughs> okay, so that's learning from your mistakes. <laughs> okay, okay, let me see. Um, I probably just, I'm just gonna do an IG3. How about rook f1? No, 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 this rook is too good here. Bishop c4 or knight g3. That's, that's what I'm gonna stay with. 
bishop c4 g3 like this there's no increment true thank you Yeah, you know, it's actually the same for most people. There are actually studies that we, it takes us some effort just from 2D to 3D. So that's why, I don't know if you can see, I have like a chessboard back here. And if I have the time and it's feasible, I just like to train or do any chess related stuff on a physical chessboard. Because like I said, I want to start playing more tournaments. And, and I know, I know it's a, it's a thing. So absolutely. All right, so can we just take that? Pawn takes, knight f6 check. Take, take, take. Can we just take, take, knight f6. What if the king goes here? It almost works. What if knight f6? No, I, I'm, I'm eager to find tactics <laughs> and we gotta be careful with that. So here we just basically changed the move order. First I came to mind, can the move queen d4 and followed by knight f6, but what if we f6 first? and then queen d4. Every time I refer you back to lesson 102, guys. On lesson 102, if you go to the YouTube channel, go, they're numbered. Lesson 102 is about a training plan. You stick to it. Basically, on that training plan, we talk about, okay, what if you get on, let's say, Monday to Thursday, on Mondays you do tactics, Tuesday you do strategy, Wednesday you do um, endgame. And of course, I give you resources. Someone left a comment that I pinned with so many resources for free that you can use to do that. So it's just that consistent training week by week that is going to get you to 2000. What I would tell you besides that is that most of my students to go from 1500 to 1700 and on, end games becomes more and more important. So pay attention to your end games. And I'm not talking about crazy end games like bishop and versus knight and five pawns. No, no, like basic king and pawn um, and also rook end games. King and pawn end games, rook end games. Make sure you got those under control. Okay, we should be winning, right? At that point, I think he was falling no matter what. Tactics in the air, always tactics in the air. It is on lesson 102. If you go to video 102, you're going to see it's about training plan. The very first comment has lots of resources. I think I put it there with the resources you guys gave me or someone said them and I pinned it. So just check it out. If it's not there, just let me know. Okay, um, rook e8. Yeah, that's the move. Tactics, 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 tactics. If they go over here, we have to consider it. Then we take with check and we collect that rook. Send the link to what? Send the link to what? Guys, click on, if you're seeing the stream, you're on YouTube. You're gonna see below the stream, there's my picture of the channel. Go to the channel, scroll down, <laughs> scroll down to video 102. We have right now 213th is the latest, but if you scroll down, you're gonna see 102. Once you get past to 103, you cannot miss it. It's right in front of you, video 102. Okay, they don't want me to checkmate. Anyone? No respect. Okay. 
cha 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 Nothing. Just boys in the picture. Hmm? Okay. You know, ever since the beginning, guys, I have never done anything for for content. I'm trying to stick to the plan that I want to follow. But with that said, we've played it here. Someone challenged me once, and I did it. I don't remember. I probably got destroyed, but we've done it before. We've done it before. If you want to play it, we could play it. No one is gonna get upset. Oh yeah, cha cha cha. You, you know cha cha cha, guys, right? If you don't, that's like this uh, Cuban music, like Cuban rhythm, cha cha cha. It's pretty nice. You know, I was in my wife and I. We were in in Croatia, and we went to this restaurant. Actually, not only in in that place, but in many places in Europe, they they actually have a lot of Cuban music, including cha 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 and, and all. That. This restaurant. We actually asked the owner, like, why do you play this music? He was like, oh, it's nice, and, and so on. And I went to Cuba, and we, and we liked it. But you got to know cha-cha-cha. Come on. Well, tomorrow tomorrow is just a game that I played, a rapid game that I played using the King's Indian attack. I found a brilliant move. I was so proud, and I lost the game anyways at the end. And then on Saturday, it's about how to defend. So they were like eight nine roles that we all think of like if i'm in a bad position what are the things that i need to pay attention to to uh, defend properly so that's what you're gonna see on to on saturday all right we got that one guys let me do a quick review see how bad we played <laughs> there you go, there you go. <laughs> All right, so what? 79%? No respect. Okay, we got the brilliant move. Knight of six was a brilliant move. All right, all right. Now, let me see. Before that... Oh, so bad. Bishop c5. What was the better move here? What was the better move? Give it to me. Queen f2, knight c5, second best move, bishop c4. Okay, so queen f2, knight c5. All right, knight f6, and rook e8. Oh, okay. Wait, was was rook e8 necessary? No. <laughs> yeah, just take it. Take, take, take. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, this is just for nothing. All right, guys, let's go to next game. Okay, so white pieces. Now let me play d4. See how. Let me see how that goes. Should I play c4? Oh, you know what? Not only not only the guys here. That tournament, since it was blitz, it was more informal. Uh, I like I. You did not hear the the background sound because I put some music on it, but it was just people talking and talking trash, and because it was blitz, so you hear the clocks tack tack tack, and then the people just talking trash all the time. So yeah, it's not easy to stay focused, but again, it's, it was just blitz. It was just blitz. And the hair, you know that that guy, he's like. He's a teenager, so you know how, how that goes. <laughs> okay, so my opponent already played. Okay, so King's Indian defense. I know we learned it as the black pieces. And here we placed it. Let's see how that goes. Right, guys automatically if you play the king's indian defense or not doesn't matter you should be able to come up with it based on the position of the center this points in the center to give you a pretty good idea of what to do 
If you don't, then you get to our middle game lessons, including number 91 and, and so on. All right, you got it, you got it. Tom, Tom, Tom. <laughs> Okay, I think my opponent is choosing, is not choosing the right plan. And we'll talk more about it later. This rookie eight doesn't look consistent. Like I don't do much down the E file. And I laugh as I, as I say this, because now he finds a way, he opens up the game, he destroys me down the E file. But we'll see, we'll see. <laughs> no, not, not per email sent, per email received. So you can send them if they don't make okay playing the right way. So you gotta strike that center. But what if I just take that pawn? Are you going to do? I'm gonna take it. Let's do it. Free pawn. Now even if I I was already up, I don't feel so bad. Mm -mm. Now come and kill me. No, we, we get the replies price by how many lines, I, how many words I had to read. <laughs> that's, how we, that's how we make our money, not from the chess lessons, but from this other business. All right, let me just, yeah, they're gonna bring the rook over, understood. Can we play three? No. Richard, wh why do you want to force the, these guys to like it? They don't like it, they don't like it. <laughs> All right, so we're already castled. I know this. we cannot leave this here for too long. Hmm. Yeah, why not, why not? Now this is my opponent trying to prove that the pawn they gave up, uh, they have compensation for it. I'm trying to prove that they don't have any compensation. So let's see who proves, <laughs> who, who gets to prove their point. Now for you, I'm gonna wait until you become a grandmaster, then then we talk about it. I know you're gonna get there. You're gonna get there. Guys, let's try to apply something that we learned back on that lesson 91. If you're lacking missing one of your bishops, typically your queen wants to replace it. So I don't have the dark square bishop. My queen should be looking down or looking on the, taking care of the darks, the dark diagonals. <laughs> Richard, Richard, this guy, they're gonna believe it's true. They're gonna think it's true. In Spanish, you know, I don't get any emails in Spanish that you say that. Now that you say that, okay. Um, okay, let's keep it simple. Let's keep it simple. Now, 
Any plans? You're able to come up with a plan from this position. Even if you if you have never played it, you should be able to come up with a plan. Now, from what I'm from my evaluation, my opponent has weak pawns on the queen side. Um, for me, I don't like my bishop, so if I could trade it, great. Also, I'm up a pawn, so if I could get to an endgame, even better. Even better. Yeah, so a3, just finally try to make con expand on the queen side. So I hesitated there because queen b3. Don't every time we move a pawn, weaknesses are created. So I thought of this, but then we have queen c2 and then b4 anyways. So let me go with my b4. Yeah, I don't want to give him anything, so... Okay, wait, wait, think, think, think. <laughs> yeah, I gotta play g5. <laughs> come on, man, come on. I'm here trying to talk nice about us and... and okay, you got... <laughs> Okay, so pawn is defended. This one is not. Move the king or h4. I really want to play c5. I just don't have the time. What? what? Okay, let me move the king out. I don't want to play h4 yet because bishop g4 is in the air. And king, king h2 is interesting because worst case scenario, just bring the rook over, I defend. Let's hope it doesn't go that far. Again, I feel comfortable. It's not like my opponent has anything, but also when I play c5, I could find ways to bring the knight to d6. Oops, sorry, to d6. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, we're going back, we're going back. the best way to defend <laughs> true true but hey sometimes the thing is that when you are attacking the best move is typically a beautiful move when you're defending best moves are typically pretty ugly but you need to know when it's time to defend, when it's time to attack. I there to get that pawn. Now I need to play a little bit with, you know, defending. And that's what we're doing right now. But this rook, I think it has to go back. I'm thinking c5 and then bishop c4. I'm thinking maybe just rerouting, maybe improving my knight to g3. Also, if I open the, the file, I get to trade a little bit. If I'm being attacked, I want to trade. Okay. Mm. Okay, 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 okay. Let's do it. We're gonna we're gonna have time to have some fun. Take, 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 take. Hey, let's do it. Yeah, the thing, yeah, that's why I played 92, because it's not the same when you do this move that I just did, challenging the rooks. Uh, and the rook is on d4. Because then even if you take, they get the pass pawn. Hey, change the move order. So I had calculated rook takes, rook takes, rook takes, queen takes, queen bishop, and then check and we get the bishop. Now, what's going on here? So it should, I think we win material no matter what, like we could just take, 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 take and we got queen versus rook and or we could take they take in between move check they block and then we take over here am i missing something let's take we get the queen oh we get the queen that's what you said 
Well, we're gonna we're gonna review this game after, but I'm pretty sure this is more accurate. Taking the rook first. So it's always good to not get ahead of ourselves. Yeah, it, if we have time, we look at our options. Rook d7, queen c4, we calculate and we compare the final result to each one of them. We've been talking about that process for many, many lessons now. Candidate moves, calculate and compare. Okay, now I don't know what happened. Honestly, what my opponent was calculating, like, this is not gonna lead to anything. Like this is just defending everything. Now we're pinning that bishop. You see, the beginner in me just wants that point. Let me see, do we have increment here or no increment? Oh, no, no increment. Okay, so we got to start playing faster. Yeah, I'm just going to get the pawn. <laughs> and, woo, did I fall for that? I just get it. I mean, it's not a big deal, but I just cannot believe it. I just didn't even consider it. <laughs> yeah, I know, but here is is it's just an event. Okay, man, come on. Okay, now we just push. We got three pass pawns. Yeah, this is. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> okay, so if you want to checkmate me, checkmate me. But this is another queen. All right, so that out. What I would do. What I said before, first go to lesson 102, learning about a training plan. You need that. You need to get on, on, on a training plan and be consistent for weeks and months to get to that next level. And as far as lessons, I think if you are, oops, what, where, where do you go? So I think if you are, uh, I'm assuming if you're aiming for 2100, you should be over 1500. So I would say, it, does, it wouldn't hurt to start from lesson 50, 52, that we start talking about superior strategy and so on. Take it from there, and if you come across a lesson that you already know the content, you feel comfortable with it, just skip it. But I think you shouldn't skip that, and then you go from there. Openings, to get to 2100 with the openings that we've covered so far is fine. The King's Indian attack, sufficient, King's Indian defense, uh, Pierce defense, and I tell you because that's what I did, and of course you send me an email anytime if you need some more guidance but get on the training plan you should be okay okay so just looking for that checkmate <laughs> we all have a beginner we all have a beginner in ass Come on, let me check Meiji without putting too much resistance. Not too much to ask. Check, check, check. It's not. Ch oh yeah, well, no way. Okay, let's play this. <laughs> Simple. And if there's any checks. There's no check on my king. Not even to delay it. Ah, there you go, H4. <laughs> no, come on, come, come on. The queen protects the bishop. Okay, you mean from before? Okay, okay, I think you're the one playing me. <laughs> okay, wait. <laughs> are, are you the one playing me? Okay, queen defending the bishop. Okay, I see what you mean. Yeah, yeah, okay. To your last question, of course, let me find you. Oh, the last thing I see is h4. That's not a question. I keep going. True, that's true. That's a good idea. Okay, answer your last question. I'm gonna keep going up, going up.
you know, to give you a, a bit answer, it would be nice to look at some of those games to see exactly what's going on. From from what you're telling me, out there to it has to do it has to do with middle game to come up with a plan. Um, it has to do that because if you don't for them to blunder um, or any game is fine then. So I would say the middle game. Middle game. Um, one of the main things you could be do back to the open. I know that you're new openings. So make sure that you're reviewing in names to get ideas. Okay, when the opening theory is over, what are the typical plans? Because that's going to give you uh, an edge. Okay, so this game, horrible. <laughs> Let me see what things went wrong. Okay, okay, so this was a miss. Ah, oh, really? Take another pawn? No, no, okay, so I'm happy with my move too, slightly but completely winning, apparently, but I'm not that brave. This should be, no, let me stop the music, guys, because I, I think it's a little bit. Um, music, music, where are you? Okay, so castle, bishop c5, b4, and then if queen b4, knight d5. No, 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 what? b4 with the idea of rook b1 and then of the bishop. So before, I didn't even think of that. Queen takes, rook b1, queen goes back, and then we simply eliminate and collect the bishop back. I did not think of that. Okay, rook d1, queen c1. Okay, this one I did consider bishop, but then what about queen b2? What did we miss here? Rook b8, rook d8, bishop b3. I'm not sure if that better. I like that better. Queen c1, a miss. Bishop c8. That h5 plan that you have done it before. B4, g5, king h2. Okay, so I, I knew that h4 would be a good move. So king g2, king h2, fine. Queen is knight g1. Knight e2, I knew I had to get that rook there. You said, oh, outpost? It's a thing. It's actually pretty annoying when I open up the bishop. Now, c5, bishop c4 is a blunder. So how do you do that? One first, okay. I was ready for that. And then rook d1, d1. That's what I calculated. Let's see if, what's wrong with my logic here? <laughs> Queen beats. And, okay, what did I miss here? Ah, queen e4. Queen e4. Yeah, and they get a the counterplay that I didn't want them to play. So you see, I calculated up to here, and I get the bishop back. But this is what I've told you before. You're calculating a variation. Don't stop when everything settles. Like, try to calculate one more move after. So that was my mistake right there. Guys, from this moment on, my opponent made a mistake. And we simply... Okay, here, you see the move was rook d7 or take the queen. Rook d7 was definitely a, a better move. So there you go. And yeah, rest, rest is history. So let me close this. Let me go to the next game. And let's do it. All right, D4, yeah, let's play four. Let's see how that goes. And let's see if that music gets better. Carol mm -hmm. can. Let me play D3, let me play D3, let me play D3. Yeah, we need to improve it, guys. That's the main thing we need to improve is that calculation, being able to visualize, absolutely. All right, let me go 92. Okay, let's kill the music. Not good. And now I'm playing this this because I want you to see that even the King's Indian attack, we learned it on lesson 73, we uh, we can apply it here. Simple. Now, g3, bishop g2, and I'm into my King's Indian attack. Bishop b2, a little bit too passive. Let me do it. Let me go g3, just to show you that, again, opening is not a big deal. We stick to what we know and then see what happens. Mm -hmm. 
108, you definitely know them better than me. You know, after lesson 100, I remember them that. I don't remember them that well. 108, I remember 106, no, 107 is the one about the Karpovian style. 108, what did I do in 108, just play games? Probably, probably. Is the lag still happening or what? Buffering, buffering. Okay, bishop g2. Okay, I gotta, I gotta take a look. I gotta, oh, okay, yeah, I think so, I know. Was it against the Carol can? Probably, probably. Okay, so let's ask this, what are you gonna do? And I think that game, if it's the game I'm thinking of, it was exactly like this. I asked them what to do with h3. I think they moved back with the bishop, but if they had taken, then they give us the pair of bishops. Yeah, 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 I remember, I remember. The tournament I played in Spain, actually. Man, I can't believe I can't believe they're still happening. I can't believe they're still happening. Unbelievable. Well, man, be safe. Be safe. Okay, so um, Let's play chess. Let chess. I believe you, I believe you, because every time you say it, you're right. And like I say, I trust you to just take over any, any time, any time. How about you dropped, uh, have you been, have, did you continue um, posting more videos or, or no? Because I know you, you took it again and you did some, ooh, wait, can we take? You did some changes, but uh, I don't know how often you're, you're, you're posting. Takes, user takes, pawn takes. Yeah, I know. I didn't. I, I removed it again because I removed it just because it was giving me like a lag or something like that. Let me see. A little bit nicer. This is for Richard. <laughs> yeah, you see, the moment the music it gets, it starts getting choppy. What tardy? Okay, makes sense. Okay, we'll put the music then. Music up. They gotta take a look into that because it looks like after a while, like we've been here for almost 90 minutes. Like after an hour or so, it gets like that. So I gotta see if it's on my, my end. Uh, point. Okay, so we're So guys, again, we got to the middle and I'm trying to think what we're doing next. Of course, simple trick in the air, like always, but uh, for the most part, I just need to push up and I should be fine. <laughs> yeah, I think it's connected to me. I get tired and everything slows down. So that's an interesting move. That's an interesting move. So I was definitely threatening simple trick. But I don't know if it's gonna work. Mm 
That was a nice detail, but I'm not sure if it was a strong move or a one move threat. Because the one move threats, once eliminate the threat, then the knight is gonna stay. It's gonna be a little bit weird. All right, check. Yeah, last time we played a, a Sicilian, we got a we, we got a break. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I know, I know, I know what chessable is. Yeah, that's why I wanted to play a four, a four, a five. But you know, it's coming in. We hold it now. How for us? We're going to find out. So mine is uh, f5, but queen h5 is more accurate. Queen h5, I'm hitting the knight. We'll, ta we'll take a look, but um, the thing h2 is that the moment I played a four, they were they were going to play bishop d4 check, so they will get away from it with a check, and the momentum to play a five. So I was playing king h2 first, preparing for th for that idea. Uh, I'm going to. You no, know, we've been here already, guys, for like 90 minutes, and this is getting choppy. So I definitely, I definitely look into it. So I think this is gonna be the last game, but we're gonna be here a week. So I'm posting content pretty often, and we're meeting at least uh, eight weeks um, live just to play. So I wanna see maybe we're live, but uh, I just don't have a fixed schedule yet. I don't wanna say we're gonna do it this time and not be able to to do it. Queen trade. I don't know. I don't think they want queen, tra uh, queen trade. Yeah, I don't think my opponent has. I mean, it seems like playing is not that safe, but I think it is. These pawns, I have my bishop nearby, the queen is as well. We're already winning major here. You mean for, for black? Mm. I don't know. Thank you, thank you. Glad to see that you are in lesson 27. You're about to get into one of the most important lessons you're ever gonna have or things you're ever gonna learn, which is on lesson 29 and 30 as well. So enjoy, enjoy. <laughs> the right you're, you're getting started but uh but yeah if you're following it if, if you're following those in, in your games you're doing your tactics you, you're going to see progress soon okay so of course the bike mm -hmm. looking, if it comes to attacking probably just bringing the rook over to it No, 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 for me, even for me. After some time, it towards the end, it always gets like that. So I didn't, they did an update and I thought it was gonna get better, but it didn't. So I need to look into it. Okay, bishop e4 hitting. Or knight e4, yeah, let's go knight e4. Now once I do this bishop, I'm going to feel way better. Yeah, that's true, h3 and everything needs to be traded needs to be traded <laughs> maybe your or maybe your energy levels guys you know uh, my advice is to but get more time because everything that you're learning and I know that you've been following these lessons 
time really evaluation calculating if not you're just playing it's coming down to your reflex so just play five five play play a little bit more time or mix them up okay but more time is going to allow you to put these things in I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna make an announcement, guys, ahead of time. But most likely, it's going to be next, uh, next Thursday tomorrow. There's a video coming out Saturday. There's gonna be a video on the different steps we need to take to defend properly. And so let's see. Live, live. I think next Thursday. If any changes, I'll make an, uh, a post. All right. Um, ooh, wait, wait, wait. Rooklift. Someone said Rooklift. That one is okay. Night G4 is okay. Yeah, I, I, I gotta think about it because this one I got destroyed in the very first game I got destroyed. <laughs> I agree with I agree with you. Do we make this interesting? Alright guys, let's just make it interesting. Just make it interesting. We have to like queen g5, we're good the way. But we have now rook and two bishop the queen. We can get some something interesting. Let's get nice, let's get something nice. I mean, honestly, I did pull on though. <laughs> nah, nah, guys, anytime two bishops, especially in this open position, two bishops and rook should be powerful, more powerful. Ah, there you go. Okay, so I'm gonna keep my Keep my titles there. Hey, guys, I mean, I know that we have a lot of kids and it's different, but honestly, if you're going, if, if you're here to improve, that's the point of cheating, right? At the same time, I don't mind it when they cheat, because I mean, if I want to improve now, I go back to the game and see my mistakes. Okay, I think we're back, guys. I know, <laughs> I think I know what the problem is with the lagging and all that. Um, my computer just restarted so that's i think it's just that it's getting it's overheating towards the end that only makes sense like after like 90 minutes there's so many things going on that it just overheats so now i know all right it's happening again mm. okay hopefully i get to make it out of this one without getting checkmated. All right, let me see, is this still happening? Okay, now I'm muted. Let me see. Just one second, guys, one second. Let me at least, let me at least say goodbye. Mm. All right, I think we're good. Okay, guys, sorry about this, Th now I know I need to do something so that it doesn't overheat but that's what it was everything the computer shut down and restarted all of a sudden so anyways thanks for being here like always we continue putting new videos every well as often as we can and i'll see you live next week okay if you have any questions let me know in the comments and i will see you i'll see you next time